Welcome back. A charity golf tournament this Friday will raise funds for educational programs in our local schools. And here to talk more about the tournament is former NFL player and honorary chair Pierre Garcon and co-chair co Josh Vandergriff. Welcome, gentlemen. Thank you so much for being here with us. So talk to us about this golf tournament. How is it different from other celebrity golf tournaments? Yes, thanks. And thanks for having us. So I think what makes our Junior Achievement Tournament so exciting is really the unique format of the tournament. We pair three adult players with one student player, which is really exciting because the student player gets to learn from a lot of business and professional people while they're on the golf course. And it really aligns with Junior Achievement's mission of supporting our youth and educating them and helping them move to the next stage of their careers. And Pierre, why is this so important for you to take part in your honorary chair? So just talk to us a little bit about that. Um, it's important to me. I, I, as a professional athlete, I believe in education and mentorship, and that helps guide our young people in our community. And Junior Achievement, we are you know, excited to provide that resource and tool so the kids have a better life in the future. Yeah, giving back to the community, right? Enjoying it. I Absolutely. Enjoy it. Okay, so what can people expect if they head out to the golf tournament? So there's going to be a lot of exciting opportunities. Um, there's going to be some raffles, there's going to be some prizes, and there's going to be an opportunity to get out there and play and, and, and compete as well. Okay, all right. And if maybe they can't make it out there, can they do anything to help Junior Achievement throughout the year? Yes, so there's a lot of opportunities to get out there and be involved with Junior Achievement. First, you can volunteer. You can volunteer in the classroom. You can volunteer with elementary, middle school, or high school students locally here in Palm Beach County and the greater South Florida area. And then in addition, uh, if businesses want to make a financial investment, there's an opportunity to do that as well. Go to our website, juniorachievement.com, and get plugged in. We'd love to have you participate. All right, Pierre, and what is it like to bond with the kids? <laughs> it's the best feeling ever. You know, the kids are themselves, and they have a lot of great questions, and we don't realize what they don't know, so I love answering their questions and giving them a, you know insight to the future. Yeah, and I mean, it's just so great to have that one-on-one -on -one time yes. with mm -hmm. them as well, right? Mm -hmm. It is, it is, because, you know, they say the craziest thing and ask the craziest thing and wonder the craziest thing, but I enjoy spending the time and giving them the knowledge. Yeah, and I'm sure they love spending time with you guys as well. Did we miss anything, gentlemen, before we wrap up that you want to add? I think you covered it. We're really excited <laughs> to host the tournament on Friday, and we're happy to see everybody out there. All right, and I know we're going to be taking part as well. WPBF 25, we are a proud media sponsor of the event. Our sports anchor, Yanni Caracas, he will be emceeing the event. Again, it takes place on Friday, and we have all the information about the event on our website right now, WPBF.com. So just Go there, hit on the Charity Golf Tournament link, and all the information that we just talked about, you'll find right there for you.